How's it going? Hi, Dom. Hello. How are you? I'm good. Thanks for joining the fun here. Yes. We had planned on doing another video. Well, we are doing one on your channel also. Mm -hmm. It's about the Note 9. And I was like, well, I don't have one yet. And you guys will not believe this came in the mail today. So I said, change everything. <laughs> We're doing an unboxing. Here it is. Which one did you get? I also have the same one that you have. Is it the lavender or lilac? Is that what the I think it's lavender, lavender? purple. Were they calling it lilac before? Or am I, I think just they crazy? were, yeah. Okay. No, I, you're not crazy. I thought they were, but yeah. this is, I mean, this color is amazing. They're pretty similar. I think this one's a little lighter. Oh, yeah. it is actually. Maybe just slightly. This is like a little more purple. Yeah. So that makes sense. Okay. This is a little more lilac. I like to call this Thanos purple. Oh, yes. <laughs> so good. So you've had it for how long? A couple of weeks now. Are you yeah. loving it? I like it a lot. Yeah, it's yeah. pretty cool. Well, I'm so excited that you're here to do this unboxing with me. Yes, this is exciting. Okay, so here we are. Oh, you also have the Galaxy Watch too. This guy, yes. Oh, this is so awesome. This is, yeah, this is interesting. I'm, I'm actually excited to look at this. So let's see, I know I have a knife here somewhere. Knife status. Yes. That's a knife. <laughs> it is. I was trying to find a purple one, which is weird. I don't have a purple knife. Do I even need this? I I'll remember just... it was really hard to get mine out of the little sleeve that it's in. Cut away from yourself, kid. I know. Don't cut towards yourself. <laughs> this is a substantial box. Yes. So this is the 512 version. Did you get an SD card for yours? I expand? have not yet. I feel like no. you don't really need it. I mean, it's 128. It. Like, I have a 256 iPhone and I haven't even used half of it yet. No, so. my sister the other day, she was like, my phone's going, it's slow. I think my, my phone's full. And we looked at the storage and it was like, <laughs> you have a 256 iPhone. Yeah. You've got like 200 gigs left. And here it is. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was so excited. Oh. <laughs> Yes, I mean, Here it would it be is. better if they had it flipped over, That's right? That's true. You want to show off the color. I mean, I would be more excited, but I already saw yours, and I've seen every <laughs> yes. single person's videos and unboxings, so this is really not that new information. But for me, it is. Yes. This is this is my first touch. Yes, it is it, wow. your first impressions. Yes, here it is. I do love the color. The color is nice. Have you seen anything so beautiful? I have. Yes, you have. It's just as beautiful. It is really, really nice. It is kind of crazy, the, the colors, though. It's like, yeah. it, it is slightly different. Huh. Yeah, just, just a little bit. Yeah, that's more of a pink, and that's more of a purple. What it's like, else do we have in here? Do we have a pair of headphones? I'm not sure. We definitely got a charger and a little dongle, adapter, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, charging mm -hmm. plug, wall warp. Oh, jeez, oh, have you guys seen these Surprise. AKG headphones? I actually like them a lot. Yeah, no, they're cool. They're pretty yeah, nice. Yeah, they came with the S9. Oh, well, nice the little. Cable. Have you guys ever seen one of these? This is called USB-C. It's fantastic, very new technology. That's a little, that's a clip to remove the tips from the S Pen. I, and it comes with extra ones, too. I did not know what this was <laughs> when I first did a note unboxing. Extra little ear, ear thingies. And that's it. That's it. Okay. Well, now that we've got that taken care of, yes, there it is. I mean, that's the unboxing. I will be doing a further test, doing some photo stuff later on. The camera is nice, I have to say. I'm excited. Yeah. So what's been your favorite feature, do you think? <laughs> if I'm going to be super basic about it, that feature where you can take a selfie with the pen is pretty awesome. That is kind of like, cool. Snap it and it takes a picture. Like. It's really cool. It seems so easy. I'm sure there's like a lot of intricate things. Did your phone just talk to you? Set up more easily by guiding you through the steps. I'm, I'm not ready yet. We're, we're chatting about things. <laughs> so what have you mostly been like doing? Are you doodling? Are you like taking notes? Cause I don't really think those are things that I realistically would ever really do. So for me, when I get like a note at first, it's always exciting right away. And then the novelty wears off mm -hmm. after like a couple of months. And yeah. I'm like, I'm not using this. So right now I'm using the heck out of the little selfie shutter That button. is cool. But I don't know, you know, it could be in a few months and I'm like, eh, just, you know, take a regular selfie. It's cool that you can just take like PDFs from your email and just sign them. Cause that is yeah. probably a struggle that I think a lot of people do deal with is yeah. trying to, to sign things. I mean, I have like a PDF of my signature that I just like copy and paste yeah. onto things. But uh, what about the camera? So it has the variable aperture, mm -hmm. the same as the S9 Plus, which is yeah. really cool. I like that a lot. I mean, if you like the S9 camera, then you're gonna, it's the same thing, basically. Yeah. They, they kind of copied it over, which isn't bad. Like, mm -hmm. I mean, you have to. It, the variable aperture is nice. I like the super slow-mo a lot, like was on the S9 as yeah. well. So that's pretty cool too. Um, the camera overall is, I mean, it's pretty good. It is a really good like, camera. It's it's up there for sure. The live focus versus the portrait mode in different situations and different hair colors. So for blonde hair, 
the portrait mode on the iPhone, it does not like it. But it works way better on my sister, whereas this one, it works yeah. pretty well with both hair colors. I would say this is definitely like top five for me, yeah. as far as cameras go. And even all around smartphones, I mean, I know the year's not finished and there's other stuff that's gonna come out, but right now, I mean, they've got it going on with the... They do, and this yeah. color is great. Yes. Oh, it's so good. Wait, we do oh, have this. Yes. Should we jump into this real quick? Well, we might as well. Okay. Jump into this. I'll, I'll let you do the honors. Oh, thank you. Oh my God. I won't cut anything. I don't think you have to cut it. I, I don't think there's actually any tape. This one's much easier to get into than the other box was. So usually I never have to cut anything, but I cut everything. <laughs> oh yeah, this is way easier. Yeah. <gasps> Whoa. See, that's cool. They actually give you the, the product right up front. <laughs> that looks really good. Do you want to take it out? I, okay. I, okay, there you go. It actually looks pretty cool. It does. It's, it's a little thick. Big. <laughs> it's a little thick. So for the first few years of the Apple Watch, I didn't realize that I should not have a large version. When I finally switched to the 38, I was like, this is the perfect watch. Like, I didn't even realize yeah. how massive it was. The 42 is pretty big. It's huge, yeah. and I had no idea. I just thought I needed to see the screen. I don't even, like, you don't, no, it's unnecessary. So I think these come in a few different colors. So this is the silver one, obviously, but then they do have a black one and a rose gold version as well. Rose gold. Yeah, they have rose gold. Oh. I know. Oh. <laughs> what? It looks pretty nice though. I I will say my one of my favorite things about the Samsung watches as of the last like year or two, I guess, mm -hmm. is that you can navigate using that the thing. Cool. You can go through the menus and stuff um, using that. But this one actually looks like you know like a real watch, I guess, yeah, aside see. from the screen. See now, that's so nice. Does it turn on? Oh, there it is. <gasps> whoa, whoa, whoa! Galaxy whoa. watch. We got something happening. It's light. It's not. It doesn't feel very heavy either. Yeah. Um, it's big. It is. I mean, it's forty six. Wow. Yeah, 46 wow. Millimeter. Okay. That's. That's even bigger than like the biggest Apple Watch. Yeah. I mean, it. Looks, I guess it just depends it, on the size of your wrist. That, but, I mean, it fits you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I do like what they like. I don't know. It just looks. It looks normal. And I, from what I saw on the internet, it actually makes like little ticking noises, like an actual watch does. Oh, that's cute. Apparently. I'm into that. But yeah. Let's see. Yeah. So you can like. I mean, I have to set this up and stuff, but you can move up and down and stuff yeah. with that little rotating bezel, which is kind of cool. That's cool. I love sort of the normalization of smartwatches. Like yeah. Michael Kors has them. I did a video about that. Yeah. And I was like, this looks like, I love Michael Kors watches. Mm -hmm. But since the Apple Watch, this is basically all I've been wearing. But with that, it also works with Apple because it's using just like the Android Wear. Yeah. You don't, you can still use your iPhone too. Were there any health benefits? Was there like? It does like all, tracks all the things. Mm -hmm. You know, like if you're sleeping or like your REM cycles and stuff oh, wow. like that. It obviously has a little heart rate sensor on yeah. the back there that can check your heart rate throughout the day. Actually, when they sent it to me, it came in like a Nike like gym duffel bag. Oh, that's cool. So like, it, it, they're kind of pushing the whole yeah. health aspect of this thing a lot. They realize like the trend of like Fitbits and like fitness bands are kind of going down, so they're trying to step up and like take that spot with like watches like this. Yeah, and the only way that I think that those sort of bands will come back is if they start tracking things that these cannot, like yeah. oxygen levels, like dehydration, yeah. like those types of things, like blood sugar, like those are the only way that I feel like those are gonna take over these smart watches. Yeah. Especially if every brand and is basically coming out with them a smart thing. I would love if there was a fitness band that was specific to fitness that would help you yeah. track all those things. Yeah, that'd be cool, yeah. But there's not well, the that I'm aware coming. of, actually. Yeah, not yet. I keep seeing all these crazy fitness things coming out. I'm like, where are we gonna like put this? They've got like fitness mirrors. Yeah. Like, like crazy things just sort of extend out of it to work out. Technology is crazy. It's amazing. I just want to be a robot. Yes, we will someday. We'll we'll we will. Robots. Yes. They'll, they'll take our brains out and put it into like the cloud. Yeah. Yes. They'll take <laughs> us to the cloud. I'm down yes. and I'm ready. Well, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you so yeah, much for bringing this. Definitely. I'm excited to try out the new phone and make sure you go check out his channel because we're going to be doing another video on yours and it may have something to do with that. So Possibly. we'll see. Okay. I'll see you later and uh, let's cut to some photo tests. We're here with the phone. Now that I've unboxed it, as you guys just saw, we're gonna do some photo tests. I'm just gonna run through a few things. One of the highlight features for me for this phone is you can store up to a terabyte of data, which is kind of incredible. I got the 512 model, but you can upgrade it to another 512, which will give you so much space that I'm not really sure if you're gonna even know what to do with it. You can probably see Jenna in my glasses there. Say hi, Jen. <laughs> We also got our Super 73 bike, so we're gonna be riding around town getting some photos and some video tests. I'm excited to try out the slow-mo, the super slow-mo. Should we try that out? 
Yeah. Do you want to super slow-mo me on the bike? Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Let's get started. facing video. I hope that the wind isn't too loud, but so far I'm really, really into the video. If you guys liked the Samsung S9 video camera, this is basically, I think it's very, very similar, if not exactly the same. There's Jenna. Now let's switch to the back camera and see, uh, see Jenna here in a second. And there she is, everybody. There's Jenna. Hello. What's going on? Filming. <laughs> So I'm gonna zoom in and see what this looks like. 2X zoom. She looks great. identify what it's taking a picture of. So when I was at lunch, it noticed that I was taking a picture of food. So it kind of auto-generated settings that would look best for taking photos of food. Shall we cruise on? Maybe we head home and take some photos in the backyard? <laughs> because it's too hard to do things out and about, especially on a bike. Because people keep wanting to stop and talk about the bike. And then they see we have a big camera, and then they're like, what are you filming? And then a lot of things Happen. I just, I don't think I should ever leave my house again. Let's go home. So we made it back home. I should just shoot all my videos out of here because <laughs> it's perfect lighting, no people are bothering me, and I'm in a very uncomfortable position. Did you spill? I spilled, I'm a hot mess. Maddie, who's a good boy? So you can, <laughs> Turn the background focus off or on. Who dropped their bone? Good shot, and you can go back in and you can adjust the background focus afterwards. I will say sometimes these photos look way better on this Samsung phone and then you share them out and they don't look as good because the screen on this thing looks so incredible. So here's another one. You can also do the close up or you can switch back to the other camera because there are two cameras on here. So this will give you the wide angle, or this will give you the close up with the background focus blur. Look at this dog. Is he gonna post it on his Instagram? I think he will. Wait, are you digging? Let's see what else we can do. The super slow mo looks really good. Oh, buddy, you're so cute, Maddie. So you guys remember the AR emoji? These things, I'm sorry, they're extremely creepy. There's no doubt about it. And if anybody disagrees, you're crazy because let's make one of myself. Ready? So smile with my lips closed and give it a whirl. <laughs> <laughs> wow, okay, here it goes. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna do that, I'm a crop top. <laughs> oh, 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 wow, okay, I'm gonna save it. I don't love it. I don't love it either. <laughs> okay, so this is my AR emoji. Uh, wow. I mean, I definitely think that I might not be okay <laughs> with what's happening. Oh, look, I can show you my feet. No tongue detection. Wowee, this is a look. Like half of my mouth is working, my eyes aren't working properly. Are my, are my eyes blinking right now? Okay, well that's good. Well, I got a lot of eyeliner on. I don't ever want to see that again. Okay, so here, oh, look at that. This is a breakfast pick. That looks, oh, that looks, wow, that bacon is super crispy. And these photos are very, very Whoa. detailed. That looks very nice. There you are. I don't happy, but I don't you, know you don't, but that's okay. Here's the super slow mo bacon. Wow. These look really good. Oh, look at you. I think that's cute. Mm. And, oh, I'm reliving this meal. It was delicious. Yeah, this looks pretty good. I feel like the coloring does not. Like the skin tones on here do not look very good. Another cool thing that I like is you can make GIFs from videos, which it's so easy to do. All you have to do, so find the video that you like, you swipe over here on the little panels, you click animation, you pick the section that you want to make into a GIF, click record, 
and then stop, guess what? You've got yourself a GIF and you can save it, share it, do whatever you want. Now, that's not really a new feature. You could do that in the S9 as well, but I think it's pretty fun. So here it is, there's my GIF. I see me rolling. It's a good one, I like it. It is a good one. I made that in like two seconds. I'm so talented, it's shocking. <laughs> well guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you go subscribe to Dom's channel and go tell him that I said hello. A huge thank you to him for coming over and doing this unboxing with me. I will uh, probably be posting some more photos on Instagram and Twitter. Oh, I forgot to, I forgot to try out the selfie. The remote's pretty cool. Um, anyway, I forgot what I was saying. Uh, subscribe to Dom, subscribe to my channel, click like on the video, hit the bell. I don't know. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Let me know what you think of the Note 9. I'm into it. I don't know where I'm going, actually. I was just, okay. it's gotta go this way. <laughs> I was just trying to exit the video and he called well, me yeah, out. You're like, where are you? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay, bye. I'm, I gotta go edit this video now. Thank <laughs> you.